I started my seventh grade year wanting to stay in shape for hockey. So this will be my tenth year. Ready and go. Working hard for the last four years, not not missing a run, not missing a workout, doing the extra things in the weight room. Taking care of myself when I when I need to get into the training room, just being there every day and doing the run. That's it. What really stands out to me that that got him to this level is that that work ethic. Uh, that drive that uh, is not just something that he's really fired up uh, on one given day or one given week, but it's uh, the long-term view. Uh, to, to run at the national championship meet, it's a big deal. Uh, it's a, just a huge competitive atmosphere, wide open course, and, and uh, the gun goes and and, uh, and everyone gets out hard and, and races. I think I ran a pretty solid race, pretty even. It's really hard at Nationals to get out with, with so many guys. So I got out a lot slower than I wanted to and had to work through the crowd and moved up to 86. So it wasn't, wasn't the ideal race, but I ran as well as I think I could on the day. So 86 in the nation. Yeah, correct. Outsiders look at running and they think it's just an individual sport, but these runners, they're with each other every day, pretty much the whole school year. They're pushing each other. They're sometimes suffering physically. It's a tough sport. Uh, so they become really close and they really, uh, they lay it on the line in training and in racing for each other. I just love being out there by, you know, by myself or with the team, just going going every day, you know, the sights around you, knowing that you're the one that is competing with yourself. It's something that you can do the rest of your life. It's a lifelong activity. 